This guy actually surprised me. I'm gonna take him in kind of the plus one plus one kind of route, but it kind of felt a lot like a Selesnia version of an Animar deck with uh, having a lot of plus one plus one counters on a lot of creatures, then making other creatures cheaper and just kind of going wide and tall that way. Let's see how it goes. Alright, this is a very interesting commander. It reminds me a lot of Animar, but in Selesnya colors. So kind of, if you think of the plus one plus one counter strategy of like an Abzan style commander mixed with the like creature explosivity of um, an Animar deck. And that's kind of what you have here. If we take a closer look at the deck, Type. We have our artifacts here, our typical ramp guys, um, as well as the uh, Obsolith. Uh, whenever we're doing plus one plus one counters, we always got this guy in here, as well as if we're doing it in green, probably gonna have this in there. For sorceries, we have just a large uh, ramp package, um, as well as some plus one plus one counters on to your creatures type stuff um, you'll see later on once we get to creatures that our goal is just to get as many creatures out as wide as possible on our board because then that makes our incoming creatures cost even less planeswalkers uh, we have our planeswalker to utilize those plus one plus one counters turning them into mana dorks um, our lands, we have our kind of basic um, Selesnya package, but with some plus one plus one counter and proliferating strategies going on here. Um, instance, we have our normal uh, kind of um, Selesnya package, enchantments. Um, we have a lot of plus one plus one counter support and plus one plus one count matters type stuff doubling your counters uh putting plus one plus one counters on all your creatures that's a crazy powerful thing that animar really can't do without having white is like stuff like cathar's crusade and feldar retreat putting plus one plus one counters on all your creatures then makes all your incoming creatures cost basically just whatever their color identity is um, so all these essentially whatever their generic mana is is going to be zero because you're going to end up putting counters on everything um, and then you have just like your evasive guys that will then fly over or things that like this that give all your plus one plus one counter guys trample Invoke, trample again. Yeah, this is a very unassuming deck, but can kind of blow up out of nowhere. Let's go into a play test. So this is a good starting hand. Oh, that out, what does this do? Cool, cool. Three, four, 
four, five, six. That's the command, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Four. And there's the background. And then this is where it should get crazy because we'll go one green to play this guy. And because of this, the two counters on him. So this gets two counters because of that. Which then would make this cost just. And now this has flying and this has flying. Makes sense. So then you just keep going, going, and going, and then as long as you have guys on your board, then that will make the commander attack. So this guy go down, you just keep going. 